started, so pull your jets, okay? Let me get back to work. Ryan, this is gonna be it. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Days Gone. We are at the Nero landing zone. Well, let me do some recapitulation. So off camera, I have cleared this area here and this area here from the infestation zones, infestation nests. So uh, plus um, there was a camp here and a camp here and I have liberated the camps as well. So we haven't been to Sarah's memorial um, because for some reason it is not available anymore for now. But we went and did a hunting session with Copeland. We killed some deers and he gave us some tips about how to hunt. And uh, that was good, good, good. So, um, now in the meantime, we were driving, um, going from a camp to I don't know where, where we intercepted, Deacon intercepted a conversation from Nero on the um, on the radio that they left behind when they were attacked by freaks and in this conversation there then this uh, in this interception it was said that O'Brien and his team will land in a zone close by so Deacon obviously um, left everything and went to this zone and here we are so technically if everything goes well um, we should meet O'Brien we should meet O'Brien so let's see where O'Brien is the chopper is there O'Brien, I assume, is the guy in white with the security personnel behind him. So, hey, Sarge, how about we make an unscheduled stop on our way back? A couple of sample traps I want to check. Let's hey, cut them out. <sighs> Let's see if. They, they come this way. Okay, so they just walked past by. Is the security guy? O'Brien, field note two zero zero six. On approach to the landing site, I observed a large swarm of insects, probably Dimonosotronus or Dendera, in a clearing well away from our designated target. From that distance, I cannot discern what was attracting the insects, but from the size of the swarm, Jesus. So we need to cross and hide in the bush. So security personnel is there. We can probably walk behind them. Okay, so security left. Face to face with O'Brien. Son of a bitch, at least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. Now, whether that been something. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly if conducting operations in quarantine zones, if I encounter any civilians or sub, 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 civilians that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? 
See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next night, refugee Nero camp. Nero protocol two dash seven states. I, Everyone was dead. Two they were slaughtered, seven. torn limb Nero from goddamn limb. Protocol All right, listen up. We're gonna do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell is you're doing out here. The hard way. I crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? <laughs> Yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember a, a knife wound. She she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead. So I'm going to ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Like you said, uh, Camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a uh, camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but... I'll check. Uh huh. And I'm gonna go with you. No, you, you can't. Please, you don't. Hey, you don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look. If you're gonna fucking kill me, do it. Okay? I did my job. Did the woman, your wife? I put her on oxygen. I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic. She wasn't gonna make it. But I got her to the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life. O'Brien, <sighs> report. I have to go. Please. Uh, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Ryan, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you, I don't care how long it takes. I'm going to track you down. And I'm going to do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. Shit. So Sarah survived. They never went to Belknap camp because the camp was overrun. O'Brien confirms that she survived the stabbing. He fixed her out. Shit. O'Brien, O'Brien. This is huge. This is huge, guys. Let's kill him up. Fuck. I'm speechless. <clears throat> Honestly, guys, I'm speechless. Alive, ah. the hell is he alive? They were diverted south. He said that he put her on oxygen. He gave her an IV. He kept her alive. She was septic, so she wasn't gonna make it. But he got her to a mesh unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said he saved her life. She, she can still be. She. No, 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 no. But O'Brien is alive. If he is. If O'Brien is alive, why not here? Shit. Can she be alive? Deke. You there? What? Finish it! Man. Uh, I thought this camp was empty. What? Have I gotten to myself yet? 
I just came up here looking for fuel. I'm still, I'm still thinking about, I'm still thinking about O'Brien and Neo. Return to Boozer, we're getting low. Let's check about, let's check a bit the map. Nice and clear, so no infestation zones that we know about. All the camps are cleared up until now, but we still have to discover a few of this map, so. Nick, you there? Who's man? Um, a few days ago, I asked you if you remembered that Nero asshole old line. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of a blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye, booze man. I'll, I'll tell you about it later. Let's attack this camp and right see what we can get. Oh, <laughs> soon, loser. Real soon. Look. <clears throat> As soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. Okay. Oh, what a news. And that's a game changing story. What the fuck did you see? I'll just take these. O'Brien, oh, O'Brien, oh, he's alive. How the hell? Is he alive? They were diverted south. He said that he put her on oxygen, he gave her an IV, he kept her alive. She was septic, so she wasn't gonna make it, but she did. He got her to a mash unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said he saved her life. She, she can still be. She no 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 no. But O'Brien is alive. Exactly. If he is, then maybe. So, okay, so let's. Are you out there, O'Brien? Oh, you son of a bitch! You better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I know you're on this channel. God damn it! Okay, you better get back to me, or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Oh, God damn it! Oh, come on, O'Brien! Okay, Dick, relax a bit. Come on. Relax a bit. So, let's find the bike. Track down the chopper. Was it the same guy the one we saw on the roof that night? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. Did he remember us? Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened to her. I, mean, I, I don't think she's still alive. What? No. I mean, no. Look, I'm not stupid, Boozer. I just want to find out, you know, what happened to her. Where she died. Let's go to Boozer. Maybe you can finally, I don't know, find some peace. I don't need to find any peace. Jesus. I, I gotta go, alright? Deacon out. Look at this place here. Jesus. Okay, so we are... Are we still heading to Boozer? Shit, I'm left spe speechless here. We're going to Boozer with some meat. Yeah, okay, so... Yeah, it was off camera. After we went hunting with Copeland. One of the missions was that... Well, not missions, but Boozer called us. Asking us to get some meat. Because he, he was running low on... Um, on food um, and uh, this is this is what we're gonna do we're just gonna give him some meat basically 
let's refuel once we once we're here. Crap and kerosene, and let's check on Boozer. Boozer. Hey, dig. Let's get some ammo. Yeah, I guess I've been Come on. on. It's gonna get cold tonight. Yeah. Bandage, rags, two medikits. Okay, so no ammo needed. We're maxed on ammo. Got you some meat, booze. Hey, booze man. I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Hey, Deke, thanks, man. I'm not real hungry right now. I'll salt it up in a bit. Okay, so. What's next? Sarah's memorial is open again. I'm not really keen on going there because I'm, I'm feeling <laughs> it's not a l waste of time but um, check in uh, what's wrong with Lisa now let's check in with Lisa Lisa, obviously you all remember Lisa from last episode, the girl that was saved. Let's get an empty bottle of beer. How are we on Molotovs? You're fine, yeah. So let's get on the bike. Can we just teleport ourselves from our camp to theirs? So this is like... Let's... No, we can't. But we can fast travel here. Yep. Okay. And that saves us like two kilometers of drive. <coughs> Let's see. So we can talk to talk and talk to Lisa at the same time. When it loads, that is. Let's talk to talk. I know. Let him in. There's the mechanic. Can I help you? Where is Tuck? Is this Tuck or Lisa? I think... Ah, uh, probably Tuck, yeah. Let's see what Tuck has to say. Lisa. They won't let me leave. Leave? Why do you want to leave? Why would you want to leave? It's exactly. Safe here. I have to work. Uh, of course, you have to eat. You have to work. Okay. Okay. Ah, okay. I have to work, as in I can't talk right now. Silly me. Mission complete. That was good. Return to the hospital's camp. This is the mission. We need to go and talk to Tuck. And Tuck should be close. There she is. Hi Tuck. We haven't heard from Copeland. Deke, you ever ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. 
Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, Tuck, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman, to death. Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt. Oh, Maria. Right? Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yep, I know where it is, and, uh... I'll handle it. I Gee. thought you might. Nice and bloody. Locate limbo. Cool. Let's go. Let's go and find this asshole. Let's fill it. Let's fill the tank with fuel and off to find this asshole then. Hey man. What? Yeah, just fill it up, my friend. Yep, more fuel. There you go. Jeez, <laughs> look at the credits. Now. Look at all the credits we have. Okay. What? Get back. Knock it off now. Right, let's go. Didn't do anything. Come on, open up. Let's go, quick and easy. Let's go and find this bastard. Yep. Limbo, where are you, Limbo? How far are you? 750 meters away, so close by. I'll put you on Limbo, Limbo. Beating up girls, ladies, defenseless people. Uh, can you call yourself a man? Let's see who's the man. Come on, Limbo, where you're hiding? Sniper ambush, oh god damn it. Where the f Where is the sniper ambush? No, no. No, no, Jesus, you can't. You gotta go after him now, they're getting away. <sighs> go after who, Tuck? Slow down. It's Roach, it's Roach. You know him, he used to ride with Leon and Alvarez. But I trusted him. Oh god damn it, Tuck, you shouldn't have. No, he's taking the rest of our drugs and headed north. Rippers. Uh. Sacrifice him! Sacrifice your ass. Come on, asshole. Saying something? No, he's taking the rest of our drugs and Where is he now? My boys lost him somewhere around Marion Forks. <sighs> All right, I'll see if I can track it down. There he is. One last ambush again. Yeah? Fuck Finally. you. That was a good headshot. <laughs> More? What the fuck? So we got a medikit, let's go and find that asshole of a sniper. Is him somewhere here? Did he fell from the tree or he's still hanging on the tree? By the looks of it, he's still hanging on a tree. If this was not him, I can't see any rifles here, so probably it's not. <laughs> He's on a tree. Yep, that's where he is, look. Okay, so, off to Limbo. Let's uh, get some bandages around us. 
let's wrap ourselves in bandages let's fix the hatchet and let's go to the bike on our way to limbo let's fix the bike first obviously we would need to fix the engine we have only five scrap I can't don't know if we can do it yes we can no 77% that's fine let's go and meet with our friend Limbo he's in a camp next to three finger jack So we should be very close, that's the camp. So we should park a bit far out. Don't know if he saw us already. No. Hey Tuck, I'm here and yeah, looks like Limbo and his crew are calling the place home like nothing ever happened. He said his face was scarred, so uh I mean more please, what else can you tell me? <laughs> Hey Tuck, I'm here, and yeah, looks like Limbo and his crew are calling the place home like nothing ever happened. He said his face was scarred, so, uh, I mean, more please, what else can you tell me? He wears a green coat. Jesus, how can you see me from there? Okay, uh, you were saying? He wears a green coat. Looks like a goddamn leprechaun. You bring me his title, Deacon St. John. And I want to cover what's left of the son of a bitch's face. Okay, he's up here. Uh, St. John up. He's covered by the tree. You can't see him. We can't see him from here, Bo. So if this is the guy. He's off. He's dead. Dead, dead, dead. Collect the tire iron. I, this is not over, guys. I'm sure this is not over. There's still a camp full of people to kill. So, at least we've got Limbo. We haven't had the, the pleasure to face him face to face. But I think it's, um, it was a good move. Kill him with a sniper shot. Everyone does that to us, so why not try and try it on others? So, hood. so let's yeah, get up a bit. By the hot springs. Let's see where all these. Come on, asshole. I am here. He thinks he's safe back there. No. Okay, so I am almost at the entrance of the camp. There goes Berta barking her ass off. So let's go up here and take repair. Fuck no, Dick! What the fuck are you doing, Dick? Don't so what with a pike bomb no one dies. Crap, reload. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is serious one. to Limbo Jack and start all over again, which is not ideal. Not ideal. So, let's go. Let's park further out, so that they won't see us. 
Let's do this. And maybe we can ambush them. They've seen us already, I think. Did they? Hey, Tuck, I'm here, and yeah, looks like Limbo and his crew are calling the place home like nothing ever happened. You said his face was scarred, so, uh... It's also... I mean, more, please? What else can you tell me? That's all of them. He wears a green coat. Looks like a goddamn leprechaun. You bring me his tire iron, Deacon St. John, and I want it covered in what's left of the son of a bitch's face. Now you hear you. Uh, St. John out. Don't know if I kill the sniper now. Okay, so let's reload. Okay, here we go. Hit. Not uh, now he's dead. Okay. Let's see if we can take some more. Is the sniper here? Yep. Well, let's take care of him. Shit, almost out. Sniper out. At least if we can get rid of some others. Would have been ideal if I hit them with a headshot, not to lose bullets. That's it, with bullets. Okay, so we need to make an entrance now. This is not working, so I have to go further in. Really. How many of them here? It's like... Jesus. At center. Let's go behind here. And let's see what we can do. Because it was impossible to deal with them from there. Let's try and draw them out. Okay. All right, Limbo, where you at? Limbo's dead, Big. Yeah. I got him. Just stop by the hot springs, have a little fun. Is that it? One down. No. Two down. Down. Four down. Mm, not a look. Let's go and get him out. There's plenty of bullets, so. Let's finish him off. Let's. I think this is the last of them. Let's see. So up on the tower, on the watchtower, there should be ammo. Yep. More ammo. Same sniper. Hang on. Get up. A pack of wolves. They look infected. They 
seem to have lost interest in us. No, they didn't. Okay, so let's start. What? Wolf, where is that wolf? There he is. More of them coming. There's another one coming. There's a whole pack of wolves, so let's get meat. Wolf meat, which is always tasty, as they say. Okay, so one, it's um, two. Okay, this one no, this one yes. So, do we get meat from um, from infested wolves? Infected wolves, not infested wolves. Excuse me. That's the question. Are they healthy wolves? Which in this case, I don't really like to kill them. Or are they infected wolves? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Okay. There's nothing here. This guy. All these. Most of them. Is this? We've killed them with headshots. Yeah? 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 Remember? The guy that couldn't shoot. Getting better. Anything we can salvage from here before we go up the tower? I'm not sure what to find in the tower, so. Let's uh, craft. Yep, 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 yep. Not ah uh, yes, gunpowder yeah. No, I don't want that. I said I don't want that. Thank you. Scrap. One piece of scrap. One piece of scrap takes us fifteen percent. Holy crap! I thought no one else was here. Let's snipe him down. Run all your time. Got you now. Sit down. Someone fall. Right into him. You shot him. Still alive. A headshot with a shotgun. Die. It's your own medicine. That's a rag. Okay. A can. What do we do with cans? Bombs? Spy bombs? Can it? Can it be? Okay, it's, there's still something that we haven't taken. It's this guy, I think. Yep, scrap and sanitize sterilizer. So we repair the hatchet. There's no to eighty five percent. We maximize our health. Well not maximize but we take some Okay, so 
that is technically ah we still need to search this guy still got this, too this on guy you. is yeah. the limbo guy hi limbo okay so not to okay here we go okay are these reinforcements people coming in or just casual drifters or more eggs so how many people it's just more there is no I guess uh, they're coming from there so we'll just meet them and greet we'll just do a meet and greet here with a shotgun uh, where the fuck is my shotgun There is my shotgun now. Better than nothing. Always need ammo. Jesus Christ, shotgun, please. Where is he? They're not up yet, no? I haven't seen anyone coming up. Men coming! <laughs> Kill him! Get him, come on, come on, try and get him. If you have big enough balls, try and get him. Yeah, come on. Yep, I did. I will do the same to you, my friend. I will spare no one. I will spare no one. Being it humans, be it freaks, be it four legged creatures. Whoever comes in my path, I will do the same and... Okay, so I think we've killed everyone. Of... What's this? Is someone who haven't checked out yet? Or... Um... Not probably. Oh yeah, this guy here. Cool, cool, cool. So we've got four scrap. Let's need to go back to. This is not our bike. However, we can sabotage. Does this mean that we will take scrap out of this bike? Yes. Oh, that's an easy way of getting scrap. You just sabotage other people's bikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. We're maxed on scrap, but let's fix the hatchet then. Is there another bike we can sabotage? Yes, look at that. Max on scrap, so there's no use to sabotage the other one. The last one found a can. Um, let's go. Let's go and get the bike and go back to that proof of death. We increase our credits. 
our trust and we should very soon we should increase the level of trust to level 2 and therefore getting better um, better weapons I haven't heard from Copeland in a while I mean as in missions because we went hunting with him deer hunting off camera remember I think he's still pissed at us because we didn't give him Leon's stash as in the drugs um, I'm not sure if he knows that we gave him to Tuck and I'm still not sure if we did the right decision or not giving them to Tuck to be honest But it seems like that we have been running errands for Tuck for a longer time, for a longer period, so... Um, so probably... Are we going in the right direction? No freaking way! We have to get the bridge. So yeah, um, probably at the end of the day we did the right decision, having worked with Duck um, for longer I guess. Okay, so we're back at camp. Today is going to be a short episode guys because I'm really, I'm really busy. I'll just kill this freaker ripper here. Get his ammo. If he has any. No. I don't want that. Molotov inventory full. Oh, I love my Molotovs. We will not repair the bike as we have enough scrap to do it on our own. We'll quick save and let's go to Tuck. Give her proof of death, hey, proof of kill, and hey, Doc. So, am I on your trust list or no? What return job? Okay. You find that son of a bitch? We did, yeah, Doc, we did. Iron tooth, just like you asked. We did, we did. <sighs> nice work. Deke, you're always <sighs> the one person I could count on to get things done. <laughs> you know, I have no idea where you and Boozer rode off to, but it's good to see you. Well, we're around, Tuck, and if you need anything, you know how to reach me. Go see Alkai. I'll update your credits. Why should we go and see Alkai? Where's Alkai? Alkai, trust in hot springs level 2 trusted. Okay, so we, we are in level 2 now. So let's go and see Alkai, who's the merchant. And he has arms for sale. Good, you're here. Yep. Hey, Alkai. Need supplies, weapons? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a poor condition firearm. Poor condition firearm. What's this? The definition of a great pump action shotgun, reasonable fire rate and damage. Primarily three average condition. Okay, and what's this average condition? It's uh, an noticeable step up, especially at close to mid range. Okay, so let's purchase Powerful. this. Good shot. You'll like this one. as a primary weapon, and let's That's also purchase good. this as a primary weapon. Was this little stubby? Unique shotgun that fits in a hip holster, not the highest damage, but its versatility makes up for it. Poor condition, I don't need that. I prefer staying with the, with the rifle as a sidearm. Okay, so now obviously we would need supplies. Rifle Can I get ammo. anything else for you? Um, what else can I do for you? Let's see. Here you go. Inventory full, special suppressor. 
thank you. We'll get inventory full on health, so nothing Come else. If you still need something. Sure, darling. Wasn't watching. Okay, so sorry. What's next, then? So this is an open mission. The rest of our drugs locate the roach, bounty hunter. Um. Okay, I would probably do this mission off camera because this is a side mission it's not um it's not it has nothing to do with the storyline with the main storyline uh i'll go and visit sarah and th there is something yeah that's what i'll do we'll go and do the mission i'll go and do the mission then i'll visit sarah if it's something important i'll just record i'll start the next episode from from there if there's nothing on i'll do sarah and do some more maintenance of camera and come back with another mission that has to do with the original and main storyline well that's it for today i really hope you enjoyed this episode as much as i enjoyed doing it if you did so don't forget to hit the like button to help the channel immensely and i would appreciate it a lot subscribe if you're new to the channel and until next time this is jerry d bye bye